It's a beautiful day in Northeast PA. I just stopped at my local farmer's market for some berries. And now we're gonna do a little shopping and you guys can come along with me to one of these uh, vendor malls here. So let's go inside and see what they got going on. Masks, of course, I'll be putting my mask on. That's cool. All in the mold. 20 bucks. This is a pretty good booth. I usually want really good prices on this stuff. Get a nutcracker. Five dollars, he's cool. Pretty. I'm getting that. The Lions Club anniversary. These are cool. I'm getting this stuff for sure. I found some pretty good scores in here before. Three piece Tupperware. Okay, and that might be worth it. I'll have to look that up. Oh, right, this is one of my favorite booths, too. This looks like just like the pitcher I just picked up for $1.99 and went nine bucks. So that's a good deal. Oh my gosh, my son has this horse thing. That's 10, 18 bucks for all these C blocks. Those are cool. Indian dog, she got a little papoose. Baby in there. Look at these. It's been mustard, huh? Oh, a hand. Oh, I like that. Top 50 though. I don't like it that much. The composite though. An ashtray. Boop. There's an atlas. There's an anchor walking. Four dollars. Bubble bath. 1994 for a dollar. I'll take it. I have to consider those quail. Oh, cool. Look at this guy. This chocolate guy's been here a while. This weird mouse thing. Baby wicker chairs. I guess little tiny doll chairs. TV lamp. Forty fives. Ooh, look at these chickens. These are cool. There is teapot creamer chicken. Hmm, that seems like a good deal in that crack or anything. Whoa.
But that Collins cookie jar is pretty. Is this the cat from Pinocchio? More, no. Uncle Timothy Stoneware. More craft. Some of the stuff I can look up when I get home. Oh, this is cool. Oh, wow, I love this pelican. How much did I want for him? 12 bucks, and I took it off the thing. Zane Gray bucks. For sure. This place is gonna be going down out of business. Oh, I got more Sarto bottles. I bought a poop ton of those last time. What is this? or something? I don't know. Uh-uh, come on, man. No, no. Shh, enough child. Power to Bubba. <sighs> cool TV play for 10 bucks. I love this. Doll hairs. No, you don't need skewers. Thank you. No, 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 no. Oh, these cool little cars. The Hot Mobile. Control the fire extinguisher. 30 bucks. Okay, I captured it. boxes cool beat can oh gosh what do you have a hitch not please why why here ha 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 you can't touch anything I know you can't touch anything oh look at this plate this is cool two dollars Dang, this thing is gorgeous. Alright, you got me. I'll take it for two bucks. Nope, that doesn't mean touch it. Yeah, I almost bought that, but it's broken. Ooh. Wow, look at this amber basket. Two dollars. Dang, that's heavy. That's pretty cool. I always regret not getting stuff but. So usually get too much stuff, so there's a mug with the dolphin in the handle. Oh, don't do that. Come on. Don't do that. Pretty. Ooh. Oh, Martha Washington doll head and legs. And Dolly Madison. I'm gonna get those for two bucks a piece. Of it. Oh, that was almost really bad. All right, you're going over here where you can't reach things. That was almost really bad. Okay. Oh, these are cute. Oh, wow, that's pretty. 19 bucks. This place always has a lot of amazing stuff, so we try to edit. Dude, uh, Seriously? Ooh. It's a really pretty tulip doorstop. 24 bucks. Look at these pretty pink plates. Summer shipped, it says. Hmm. That's cool. <laughs>
Can you stop touching things, please? Oh, that's cool. Four bamboo trays for two bucks. Push my baby past here so he cannot reach anything. Whoa. Hacha and Mickey go. That's cool. Eight bucks. Hmm. That's pretty cool. Make it right here. For these candle sticks, those are cool. Candles broken. Sit on your bum, please. You better sit on your bum. Yeah, you used to have a whole back building back there, and now it's gone. Wow, look at this gas iron train. Oh my goodness, that's cool. Heavy. Stop! Stop it! You're being real obnoxious.
The Holly Hobby. Mm. Yeah, I have that one at home. He holds all my uh, miscellaneous screws. And now I'll do a super awkward voiceover because if you didn't notice, the wind is blowing pretty hard. And so I'm going to talk this way and my mouth is not going to match up with what I'm saying. So welcome to this super awkward video where I didn't feel like reshooting this whole entire haul. So I spent 50 bucks on this trip and you guys went shopping with me. Here's one of the items I picked up for $10. Uh, these are for me personally, most likely, unless I look them up and they're worth a million, but they are super awesome yellow colored Tupperware containers. You always need to check the insides of these type of things and make sure they're not crusty. These were not crusty. They're in very good shape. And I go a lot to market, so I end up with like bagged food that needs to be canned. So I picked those up for myself. That... That's something we're all uh, used to seeing from our past is the Tupperware containers. So here I have, these were $2 a piece. They're like doll making kits. So they're a porcelain doll making kit. This one was Molly. Oh, geez. I can't remember her name. The other one's Martha Washington. But they come with the fabric to make the body. They come with the bust or the head. And then they also come with arms and legs to make these little porcelain dolls. And for two bucks a piece, I thought that was pretty cool. Yeah, Martha Washington, there she is. And there's Martha's head. Whoa. <laughs> this was a pretty fun item. This is like still in the packaging. The packaging is pretty crusty, but this is a donkey decanter. So yeah, here goes some cars by, which doesn't usually ever happen on my road, or at least not very often. We get horse and buggy quite often. Anyway, donkey, donkey decanter. He's carting a barrel. So that's pretty cool. Hopefully you can see it through there. Yeah, you can see it pretty good. Okay, so then it also has four brown little sh handled shot glasses that go with it. And I think I paid, I want to say I paid five bucks for that guy. This is a bubble bath uh, bottle from 1994. It's the skeleton crew or something like that. My speculation is that this character is from the He-Man like Skeletor series, but I could be totally, totally wrong. In which case, here's a visual. Bam. If you know who she is, maybe uh, comment below and let me know. Because I have no clue. Anyway. <laughs> Let's see. In 1994, I was seven years old. So This little guy, I have picked up and looked at every single time I've been in this shop. And I've been in the shop a lot. The fact that nobody else bought it was not a red flag for me because I thought it was pretty cool. Oh, here we go. Some more cars. And this guy, he just stared at me so hard. It was awkward. <laughs> People have a staring problem, I said. So anyway, this thing, really, really cool, like mint green color with these funny little baubles on the side. Just like a pretty cute little mid-century planter or vase our pencil cup or etc etc you know insert speaking of chocks insert usage here so i paid four dollars for that one which is pretty pricey for me oh well moving on here's tinkerbell one dollar she was the first little thing i picked up in the shops today um i was really surprised i went to an estate sale and i got a little like snow white nightlight and ended up selling it for $80. So I always keep an eye out for like the vintage Disneyana because it usually sells and sells for like good prices. Definitely more than I pay for it, which is the goal, right? <laughs> See my baby there. He's he fell asleep on the car ride home. Little carved doctor. The little folk art doctor. He's got a stethoscope. I thought he was really cute. I've gotten a bunch of these and they're usually like salty sea captains with little pipes in their mouth that's what i find most often in these little carved things but the doctor was unique so i picked him up 
this um, gives me 80s feels pretty hard. I don't know, just like the design of it, the marbled white with the black to me is totally 80s. Fabulous 80s style. I really love that little vase though. I picked up these bamboo trays for $2 a piece. These are good for decor, obviously. Put your little trinkets on there or, you know, your hairbrush and your your makeup set, whatever. You know, y'all know. But this is in right now. It's boho, it's hippy dippy, it's minimalist. All those things are super popular at the moment. <clears throat> I bought this for a dollar. This, the picture doesn't excite me very much. It's a little scratched up. I don't know anything about it. I'll probably look it up. But the frame is like a solid metal, a light metal. Uh, so for a dollar, I thought that this metal frame was definitely worth picking up. This shirt's for my buddy Jace. He's obsessed with excavators and blue and blippy, so you know what? I just couldn't, I couldn't not pick him up this t-shirt. Oh, this vase. You guys saw me pick this up for three bucks in the store there. Uh, it's just like a tan colored pottery vase or stoneware. I'm not really sure, but it has a awesome brown and green decoration on it brown is my favorite color oh here comes the rain Doo -doo. okay it's raining now just so my camera doesn't get wet i am having it underneath the tailgate of my car so here is the last thing i bought I paid two dollars for this kind of serving plate in the depression yellow with a really really pretty design anyway that's all of it you guys oh hello mr dogo <laughs> If you like the video, hit the like button, and if you hit the like button, then maybe you should subscribe. Oh, that was pretty close to what I was actually saying. Anyway, <laughs> subscribe either way, and uh, I'll be coming at you with more info. Happy hunting!